Dishwashers that use heat to sanitize the dishware require a rinse temperature of at least 180 degrees Fahrenheit to properly sanitize. This high temperature rinse is what ultimately brings the surface temperature of the dishware to the FDA required 160 degrees Fahrenheit. Paper Thermometer's Dishwasher Rinse Temp Thermal Label RW180 allows the user to accurately verify that the dish machine's final rinse water temperature is reaching the needed 180 degrees. Here's how you use it. First, you need to locate the rinse water pipe of your dishwasher. This is a vertical pipe that can typically be found on the right side of the machine towards the rear, or on the back side of the machine toward the right corner. For this demonstration, we have a Hobart double door dishwasher with the rinse water pipe on the right side. Now, we remove the label from the sheet. You will notice that there is a non-adhesive section on one end of the label. This forms a tab to allow for safe and easy removal of the label after the test. Apply the label to the rinse water pipe carefully, with the non-adhesive tab hanging off the pipe. The pipe will still be hot from the most recent cycle. Protect hands when applying to avoid burns. Next, we run the machine cycle as normal. The temperature sensitive square will turn black as the temperature is reached. You can observe this occurring when your machine reaches the rinse portion of its cycle. After the test, we peel the label from the rinse pipe, making use of its non-adhesive tab. Be careful, the pipe will be hot. Wait a minute or so to allow some cooling and avoid touching the pipe or wear an oven mitt or other protection. Once the label has been used, the temperature sensitive square will remain black. It will not revert back and can be a lasting record that the 180 degrees temperature was reached. You can save it for your records or discard if no longer needed. Ask your food service supplier for the new RW180 Dishwasher Rinse Temperature Thermal Label or order online at paperthermometer.com. If you have questions, please email info at paperthermometer.com or fill out the contact form on our website.